Okay, here we are in Virtual PC running Monopix, and this demonstration is going to show how to start Mono Development IDE as well as creating a very simple text based Hello World application. The first thing I'm going to do is come down here and start my terminal session because that is how we start Mono Develop. Alright, my session is open, so what I'll do is go ahead and simply execute Mono develop. This is going to start the Mono Development Integrated Development Environment and I'm going to pause the video while it starts up. Alright, here we are with Mono Development. I'm going to go drag this guy over here so it's a little easier to work with. And then maximize. As you can see, the default view shows us our help files with the handbook, class libraries, and so on. What we're going to do in here, since we're simply creating a very simple Hello World application, I'm going to come up here and say New Solution. And we'll come here and so let's say we're going to make a console project because this one's this is one that we want to run in a command line. And we'll come down here to Hello World. And right. You can see that the project is going to be created at our home directory under Mono Development Projects, Mono Development Projects, and Hello World. This is going to go ahead and create all the necessary files, directories, everything that we need. One of the nice things about the Hello World application is it comes up all set right for us. We've got our using system, class main class, void main, and console.writeline hello world. Up here under the run menu, we have compile and compile all. I'll go ahead and hit compile, which will direct mono to create the application such that it'll be executable. In very similar fashion to Visual Studio 2002 and 2003, we have our output window. You can see down here that it is working on it. And when it comes up, it'll tell us the good news that we have one succeeded and zero failed. Voila. One succeeded, zero failed. Personally, when I test my applications, I like to go to a new desktop test it there. Since this is again a console application, we'll have to open a terminal session. And here we are. I'll go ahead and do an ls and you can see up here we have our mono development projects folder. So I'll say cd mono develop projects. And here's our Hello World folder that we created. Again, you can see here that we have our bin folder, and this should all look very familiar to Visual Studio users. And finally, we have a debug folder. Here's the output of the application we created, Hello World.exe. Unlike in the Windows world, we cannot simply say hello world because it fails in the shell. What we need to do is say mono and then pass the executable as a parameter. Hello world.exe. This is the simplest of simple applications and you can see it simply says hello world. In another, in another demonstration, we're going to show how the same code runs under Windows exactly the same way.